I want to give you some tips about uh, publishing a book. So uh, the first thing that you should do when you're thinking about publishing a book is look at everything that you've published already. If you're a lawyer, you've been publishing your whole life. You've been writing motions and memos and letters and, um, and goodness knows what else. You may have articles. Uh, you uh, certainly, if you're um, a professional of any kind, you may have been blogging. Look at everything that you've written and throw it all in a pile. Not literally, but figuratively. Throw it in a pile and organize it. See what it looks like your book might uh, consist of. Throw out the stuff that doesn't fit the theme. Um, whatever it is that you're writing about, you're giving us your unique perspective on whatever you think your book's going to be about. And by the way, that's going to change over the course of putting this book together. Um, it may change dramatically, but it certainly will morph a bit over time, so be prepared for that. Take everything that you've already written and organize what you like into a book map. And at this point, uh, you'll have material and you'll be seeing gaps in, your, in what makes sense to be your book map, what's, where your book is coming from and where it's going, where you're taking the avatar um, that you've chosen where you're going to get him to the end of the book, um, you'll see gaps in your, in your map. And that's what you need to write now. Uh, you've already got the basics because you've got the stuff that you've already written. Um, you may have motions, memos, letters from a certain case, and you need to write up the rest of that story. Um, you may be missing chapters because you may have um, stuff that you've already written about facilitation or about um, coaching or about uh, you know a certain aspect of giving financial collaborative uh, counseling um, and there are other aspects that you want to write about um, so there are missing chapters once you've organized that you've got a book map and you're ready to move forward you're going to aim for 35,000 words um, that's the average size of the substance of a book. Uh, it'll obviously end up being a lot longer, maybe 50,000, 55,000, because you've got your foreword and your, your testimonials and what people are saying about this book um, and your uh, prologue, your, you know, you may have uh, appendices, um, you may have samples, uh, indices. Um, so it'll end up being a lot longer, but the substance you should aim for at least 35,000 words, and that's my tip for the day.